Hey guys, welcome to my channel. This is Nicholas No H, and I'm back with another XG reaction. And we got a, a double header. Um, I'm first gonna be reacting to their latest comeback, which is called Shooting Star. Uh, really looking forward to this. I heard like a five second clip on Twitter. I didn't know it was like auto playing or whatever, so I quickly turned it off. But like the the little part that I did here, I think this is gonna be very much up my alley. Like maybe my favorite song from them. Um, if you know the rest of the song kind of goes in that direction and then also left and right um special special stage i think uh, it was titled on their uh youtube so we're gonna be checking those two out if you've never been here before welcome uh if you have been here before welcome back i've been reacting to xg for about maybe like four or five months now maybe a little longer i'm not too sure yeah this this journey of seeing this group kind of come out of nowhere at least for me and uh you know they're kind of aspiring to be this global group and they're slowly but surely gaining fans like even you know right when i started reacting to them there was still a lot of people that uh were checking them out interested in, in seeing reactors react to them i feel like you know the last few months they've just completely taken off and i think as they continue to make music grow their catalog a bit you know make make more content for people they're just gonna you know take the world by storm they already had the, the rapping talent the singing talent uh you know that their their choreo and, and dance uh, prowess is, is amazing so they, they kind of had the full package the one uh like not complaint but the one concern i had for them is as far as uh really taking hold of the, the market that they want was finding their own sound and i think they're they're taking steps towards that like like i said i haven't heard these songs so i don't know yet but i think they're really starting to like uh know who they are um the producers as well as the members themselves and kind of uh just become this group that is synonymous with uh like an xg sound you know even if, if you pride yourself on being all rounders and able to make all types of music and all types of content you still kind of need that um very bass sound that people are going to be drawn to and uh, attracted to uh or else you know you're always going to be hopping around and even though that's fun uh i think it's always nice to have like that your own uh color uh in in the music industry so yeah uh check out my past playlist if you're interested in seeing more xg um also a i have a patreon i will create content for that in the future still haven't gotten to it but i've been saying that for a while yeah if you do like my content on uh youtube here uh please consider subscribing it really does help it helps let me know what is wanted and i can try to get more of that for you guys um xg is already regular on my channel so you, you can always look forward to that in the future but uh, yeah, let me know what else you want me to uh, check out from them and I'll try my best to get to it so Yeah, with that out of the way, let's get to the reaction. Uh, I'm gonna be beginning with shooting star. Can't wait uh, Let's get right to it Ooh. To my toe, shining like canary diamonds. Whoa, 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 whoa. First of all, the sets, like compared to their past few videos, this is way like their budget obviously increased uh for this. And the beat is very minimal. Um I feel like it's it's gonna, you know, continue to build, but it you know, it's you have these very in your face vocals, you know, their 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 um personality I feel like is already shining through. Like a confident not that they have like a, an ego like an ego isn't a bad thing, but it's like they're very confident in themselves. You know, to survive in the music industry, I think you need to have that. But they portray it through their raps and through their singings, through the lyrics as well. So I I'm getting more of that vibe from that. Um, but yeah, I really, I just wanted to point out that you know they look amazing, but um, the atmosphere and the and the sets already feel more grand. And um, yeah, I want to see how it develops. Uh -huh. Uh, everything I do, I do a A1 Flawless, make them go insane Pins and money, I'm wired Always looking fresh, got the green in my diet Head to my toe, shining like canary diamonds Yeah, reading cool kids, nothing to it Going stupid, saucy Oh, movement, never losing Make your moves stay popping I do pause a lot, so if you don't like that, I'm sorry. Who was that? Maya, uh, Kakona, and Harvey? Back to back to back? Like, it's like when they create those super teams in basketball, you know? Like, Wade, LeBron, Bosch. Like, you can't have back to back to back like that. I gotta see what I think about the auto-tune. Um, I, I'm not I'm not a person that, like, is against it. I think using it um, in a lot of songs really creates a, a different atmosphere. It can really bring certain... Uh, it, it can enhance a, a song a lot. Um, so I, I want to hear the rest of the song, but I don't mind it right now. But we'll see, because I also like their natural voices and, like, you know, un unmodified... Uh, them unmodified rapping or singing so uh we'll see if i like it or not by the end yeah sounds really nice so far uh i'm gonna go back again anyway let me shut up 
and actually get through the first verse to the chorus because I'm still very intrigued about this song. Everything I do, I do a A1. Flawless, make them go insane. Pendemonium, buy it. Always looking fresh, got the green in my diet. Head to my toe, shining like canary diamonds. Yeah, freedom cool kids, not into it. Going stupid, saucy. We a movement, never losing. Make your moves stay popping. Wow. Those high hats. Oh. I like them bring the, the hi hats and the claps back in. Damn, that chorus is very pleasing. Very pleasing. I'm still learning all the members, but I think I think it was Hanada on the chorus. Jur and was it Jurin? Juria and Jurin always mix me up. Just the, the names are very close. Man, I, I really like that atmospheric, uh, like wondrous kind of floaty feel the chorus bring manages to bring that y2k aesthetic that is very popular right now um and, and at least in k-pop i i know obviously and regardless of what people think it this just sounds really nice i like that's it's very melodic uh a melodic heavy chorus because it matches well with the rap heavy versus before that it's like a cool breeze is hitting you when that chorus hits it's so nice uh it's gonna be stuck in my head dare i say i might like this one uh this song already even though it's you know a minute in uh, I like it more than the their past um, songs, and I, I really like them. Uh, I just had like certain things that didn't work completely for me, but as a whole, they were still good songs. But this one, I really have like no complaints so far. Yeah, they're they're doing justice to that to the to this concept, uh, music video wise. It's really cool. Uh, I love the the play with the you know they're in this like dark room. Uh, everything's lighting up, uh, like rainbows and, and kind of uh, this. And I'll play it. You know, the rainbows and they kind of get in this line I guess they're before that but oh, cool. I want to hear that part again my, my eyes are tearing up I don't know I'm not getting emotional I don't think I have allergies earlier but uh, yeah, the song just makes me feel good, man. Uh, I really like it. Can't say enough, honestly. I love how in the back it still has that main rhythm. And the claps added. I love her hair. Cause we cool and suit and booty just for fun huh? You could run up on me, I'm too out of this world I got the spaceship jumping ready for my lunch I don't care for my bread, I'm just going dumb I ain't trying to buy your shots, but they do it long I know they're watching me, I'm on a wannabe Nobody touching me, I got this energy mm. This pre-chorus, man I love the choreo with the uh these like light up what is it rings or something that they're holding mm. Ooh, body rolls I like the choreo with that. People are gonna eat that up. Ooh. Sounds 
Sí. Oh. I'm sorry. I, I want to hear the last, the whole like final chorus, like final pre-chorus, and you know everything leading up to that. I think it starts here. This is amazing. I love how they took everything out. Very atmospheric, and then it builds. Vocals are a joke in a good way. kidding me i mean come on that's not that's not fair like they murdered that um the vibe that isn't brought to you often in this space whatever you want to call it the music is kind of cyclical in a sense because you have sounds that were very popular at one point goes away because you know trends um also you know they bring great music but they can also end music early so like if a bunch of people start doing the same kind of sound people get tired you know uh, other genres come in focus especially in k-pop or adjacent um and genres you know even rap you, you can have a kind of uh like lo-fi sort of uh like sound wave kind of kind of rap um being popular at, at a certain time you know then you go back to more harder uh you know kind of like 90s rap boom bap type of stuff you have west coast sound uh you know that that creeps in southern influences that are uh you know like very uh bass oriented uh, like just music you, you blast in your car. I feel like XG is really tapping into a sound right now that they're not doing it in a way that seems like it's um, copying anything. Like it's, it com feels completely original. You have their specialty, which I, I mean, I feel like their rapping is, is really top notch. Like, you know, they have some of the best young rap, like rappers, but just young rappers that can still improve, still uh, find their, their niche and, and what they really like to do at, at like rap rap wise rap, rap style and it really married the you know this vibey y2k chill serene I, all i can say is a good vibe type of song uh and it, it's feel good and it, and it makes you it's very replayable it's something that you're really not gonna get sick of i feel like this this type of music that you can always just kind of put on it and it's gonna uh bring your day and make you feel good yeah i really like that i love probably the pre-chorus was my favorite part but the chorus is, is very close the, the second part of the chorus uh particularly when they start adding in the claps and uh, kind of builds um, really really dug that i want to see a full performance of it because they had some some of the choreo in it but i really want to see like well it, it looks really fun and uh catchy uh the choreo so i think that will also be fun to watch i always try to see if i have any critiques to it um but this really nothing maybe small thing like i always feel their lyrics kind of like nonsensical at times but it's very like braggy and fun so i get it but it's still fun like it doesn't take anything away from it so uh yeah uh, man that's ultimate like straight up playlist right away uh and very very happy that they came out with this this is the, the sound i was looking for from them they delivered beyond my expectations with that so uh yeah on to uh what was it left and right right left left right okay i'll try not to pause as much in this one because it's already a long video i don't want to edit too much but uh yeah very impressed already so three two one let's go I love how that sounds. It has that lo-fi feel, minimal. I got what you want, I got what you need. Moving like we don't follow anything. It's choreo. Oh, left, right, get it on the flow. I want to see you left, right, get in my zone. Ha. Then we hit the slide, ready for the swing. We don't want to. Damn, 
about like this. What the hell has gotten into them? They're like I knew they were talented, but now they're starting to make the like type of music that I really like. Uh, that's dangerous. I don't know if it's it's the like a live stage, so the the vocals seem a little bit more pronounced than it should be. But I think it's just because it's a live stage. I think the mixing is better, um, like on Spotify or something. But uh, they, they, yeah, I really dig that the instrumental and their voices on top of it. Harvey's coming like that? Come on. I love that shoulder work. that little pocket maya maya is one of my favorite rappers in, in xg i know everybody loves kakona I, li I like i mean i love her raps let's be honest she's great but maya is special too uh don't sleep on her and the vocals like So I'm older, so like my references, a lot of people are not gonna get it. Uh, but actually, I was pleasantly surprised. My last XG uh, reaction, you know, people knew what I was referring to. So maybe they're at like the average age of their fan base is not as young as I think or, or thought. Um, but that cadence and this and this very specific like pocket of of sound that they're in right now, amazing by the way, really reminds me of like Craig David. Um, I'm trying to remember the exact song. I, I may put it here. It, it once I remember in, in editing, but. Hey boy, come on by the so I knock at the door, you were standing with a bottle of red wine, ready to pour, just in a long black satin, at least to the floor. I love Craig David, and, and this, you know, I'm really in these kind of vibes, uh, maybe like a more mellow version of it, but yeah, they're killing this. The choreo is very technical, um, less maybe catchy than Shooting Star. It's catching my eye a lot, and maybe this, it's because it's a live stage and the whole uh, performance is in choreo, but it's very, it, there's just so much going on that I love it. Tell they're they're kind of in their zone right now, just you know musically and and uh their choreo it's it's uh very impressive very i'm blown away so far are those just like like these chimes or Lighter synths in the back coming in.
Come on. Dare I say they've like leveled up? Um, I was just gonna make. I mean, I was thinking uh, of making a just a video on my channel that you know was asking people that check out my channel what you really want from your reactors. Do you want every reaction to be positive? Do you want it to be critical? Do you want, um, you know, because my my personal philosophy is if I don't like a song, I'm not gonna upload it because one, a lot of it's personal preference. A lot of it is personal taste. And if I'm just gonna, you know, sit there and kind of bullshit my way through the entire thing then it's not people can see through it a lot of people can see through that so for me i tend to like all of this stuff that i upload just because i am uploading it like the fact that i am uploading it i enjoy it but you know i still have small critiques and and you know little things that uh as far as my personal taste or even um or just little things i noticed that could you know put it to, to another level for me uh just because i know how talented uh the producers and, and, and these these girls are and you know people that bands whoever i listen to they put a lot of work in and you know they 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 don't get that far without being talented so i can never just like completely disregard anybody that i, I upload but man like these i really really have nothing bad to say this especially this one both, both of these songs great instrumentals they uh shooting star it builds a bit more and has more going on i think um but this one it just it, from the beginning it's just a very you just kind of get taken back to this uh, particular time and, and place and they don't switch it up too much with the song uh, they add little things um with their flows uh the cadences of how they rap but you're just taken back to the specific time and for me you know i'm getting that like mid 90s very feel good r&b type of feel um and i think they're trying to tap into that a lot, a lot of groups are but a lot of them don't you know it doesn't really hit like like this hits uh so i think xg really found something special uh with their sound i hope it continues because uh, you know, they're not going to continue making every sound sound like this, but I think they can capture a specific charm that is not, uh, not, not a lot of groups are able to do. And, um, yeah, I can't I say enough great things about them. They blew me away with these two, uh, songs and I'm definitely going to keep listening afterwards. So, uh, let me stop it here. I've been rambling. I've been praising them so much, but, uh, they deserve that. If you want me to check out more from them, let me know what you uh, want me to check out and recommend it in the comments. Can't wait to hear more from them. They're, they're really they're really up there right now uh, they're, they're uh, steadily climbing my my favorite groups yeah keep showing them love keep supporting them um and i'll keep reacting i'll see you next time